what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel and today's video guys i prepared a brand new method for you to reduce your input delay here in fortnite chapter 3 season 2 and get closer to zero input delay if you guys enjoyed this video please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel this would would say so much and without any further ado let's get straight into this topic Yeah, guys, what I want you to do now pretty much in the first place is click on the first link in the description where you can find my website, guys, where I upload all of my FPS boost packs and pretty much everything. And then you want to go here onto input delay packs, guys. You might maybe get like a small pop-up ad and then afterwards you can open it up. Just simply scroll down a little bit and here on the top left is going to be a post with exactly the same name and the same thumbnail as the video you're watching right now. Then you're going to click onto it, get redirected, where you're going to scroll down and here you find download, which is going to redirect you to Google Drive, guys, where you can download a zip file, yeah? Anything else as part of an ad or some other stuff here so therefore only the zip file guys please and then it's going to look like this here reduce latency and games guys and for some people i already explained this so often guys all the tools i show here or tweak packs on my channel literally i utilize on my pc like i'm running this right now here if you get like anything like a warning from windows defender or some other stuff it is because these tweaks or packs do need administration rights you know like you can literally scan them with like any antivirus whatsoever you will get nothing i promise you and then what you're gonna do is go here onto extract all guys extract it all onto your desktop and then you're gonna have these three files in here and what we're gonna do in the first place guys is go here onto hardware acceleration and actually click on the first one the first one is disable hardware acceleration and the second one is re-enable if you should have any issues afterwards but me personally i always disable hardware acceleration since it's just one of these processes guys which puts such a huge workload on your windows pc so therefore we're gonna click onto it go here onto yes guys and then it should say here the keys and values have been changed guys then we already done here with this first one then we're also going to click onto game recording and this is pretty much like the windows built and recording software which you can of course also disable guys you know i have like tons of these packs guys where you can always like disable unnecessary software and this is like a new one so therefore you're going to click here now onto disable game windows recording click here onto yes again i don't know what's bugging behind my folder but here it is and the keys and values containing and and then like the following registry tweak have been changed guys and then we're already done here with these two so we're going to move them aside and now we're going to focus on windows Windows Automotive Tweaker 4.8 um, which is the newest version guys which we're gonna launch here now on our PC and it's gonna look like this here you know it's gonna first of all tell you like all of your system specs you know your processor how much RAM you're running and all that stuff but what we're going to do is go here over to performance actually and you can see guys that all of these tweaks which are already applied here you should copy a hundred percent auto end non responsive programs restart shell automatically after some error increase parity disable smooth scrolling disable edge tab preloading disable windows time services disable tablet input services you know unwanted services pretty much on your windows pc so and after we clicked on it guys it's going to refresh your screen real quick and then you already apply these here 100 percent so you guys and then we're going to click over here now to security and privacy and what i want you to do is copy all of these settings here which i have checked guys of course don't disable your task manager or control panel or stuff like that but i just like figured here out like the ones which are a little bit less necessarily which you can 100 percent disable then you're going to click here again onto apply tweaks and after you click on it guys your screen should again refresh and then we're already done here we can close it now here completely guys it will tell you since you have applied tweaks we recommend you that you restart your computer real quick so therefore yeah that's what you're going to do now restart your pc and then we're already done here and yeah guys with that said this is it for today's video if you enjoyed it please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel this would have made say so much and if you still have any more questions feel free to ask me them down in the comment section below and try to answer as many as possible and with that said have a great day have a great night whenever you're watching this and until next time stay awesome i'm out that shit too light Big foreign, hoe come get inside Diamond Gucci, Lee, come take a dive